Uh, well, I'm here to present my work, so I have a poster with me and a poster discussion. And actually, I just won the poster award. That was very nice. And uh, so I'm presenting my work to a broad audience here. So we have developed a radiochromic uh, dosimeter, so you can see a dose distribution in three dimensions. So you read it out with optical CT, and um, then uh, this dosimeter must first be developed. So we have looked at the physical and chemical properties. Um, we had a problem in the beginning that we had dose rate dependence. So when we radiate with two grays per minute, we got better response than with six grays per minute. And that is a big problem in, in the clinic. We want it to be the same. Um, and what I found is that when I increased the chemical uh, dye uh, concentration, then we could get 0% dose rate dependence. And that was very nice. Well, for us, it's good that we can change the chemical composition so anyone in the world can make this dosimeter. It's not commercial, so everyone can check our results. And then we can uh, make it so that it, it's perfect for what we need it for. So, for example, if we want to extend for, to proton therapy, then we can also change uh, the dosimeter to fit for proton therapy. And this is very good for the patient because you need to check the treatment of the patient and um, be clear that your treatment is correct. Um, and this you can check with this dosimeter. Well, it would be something you would use when you are starting up a new type of treatment uh, to check that everything is working as it should be because it's a little bit time consuming. So it's not something for every patient. It's uh, before a new type of treatment, you would use it. And then you can see if, yeah, of course, if you have too much dose or in the wrong place, or uh, if your beams overlap correctly or all of this, you can check. <laughs>